Hey guys, it's Patrick Johnston, managing broker, co-owner of GoDominicanLife.com, right here, your real estate company throughout the Dominican Republic. We're here today, beautiful Las Serenas Beach, right across from our office. Yes, our office is on the beach, and we're here with a bunch of fine young men, except for uh, Alex, who's not young, but we're experienced, and that counts more than anything else. These young men, and this well-seasoned man are here joining our team today uh, so we as we uh, further expand our team nationwide here in the Dominican Republic. It's very important as we build our team, we, we build the business unlike a normal real estate brokerage. Collectively as a group, we're now at 30 people nationwide and we work together as a group for you as the buyer or you as the seller at all times. Through all of our divisions of our company, we have mortgage, property management, short-term rentals, uh, custom beach villas, project construction, and real estate sales. All of those angles help us grow, and a lot of the people are generally behind the scenes, as I've talked about in previous videos with marketing, general operations, administration, finance, and accounting. They get less of a credit, but believe me, we rely on those departments to make the front-end sales system shine. So nationwide here in the DR, we have until today, we have six sales uh, people on our team, uh, three in Sisua and three here in Las Terrenas. But today we're adding the next level to our team. So guys, welcome. Thank you. So on my right, you have the well-seasoned man. His name is Alex Gomez. He's a native here of the Dominican Republic and, of course, been in Las Terrenas for how many years? 12 years now. So just a couple of weeks, right? 12, 12 years? Yeah. <laughs> we have Zoran. Zoran uh, uh, it we're, it will be on our team in Sasua. Yeah. He is both uh, a Dutch national and Dominican. a Dominican citizen. Right, right. So uh, you have the advantage of, uh, yes, of, having both. of all things. Right. And Zoran will be uh, training on our team and learning the processes here for a couple of weeks in Las Terrenas, but of course to be positioned in our office in Susua Cabrete in Puerto Plata. Ivan is a rock star. He's a conquistador, originally from Spain. His father is the one and only Lucien, who's our video guy and DJ extraordinaire. And Ivan has joined the team to also learn the process of how to become a real estate rock star here in the Dominican Republic. Yeah. So, so we want to brief you on sort of the things that we're doing along the way because these guys will be in the initial stages for the next uh, six months to 12 months uh, operating in, uh, in the background with our national sales team to provide all the technical and sales support they need as they learn the process of real estate as well to help uh, Odile, Margarita, Sophie, Stephen, Barry, and Eugenio on front end sales, but six to 12 months from now, these guys will be their own rock stars. And obviously, uh, by age and beauty, so age and beauty on this side, and the youth and vigor on the other side, everybody in real estate brings something different to the table because, uh, I mean, these guys, the two younger guys on this side, sorry, I said that wrong, the two younger guys on this side bring the experience and knowledge and sort of like a well seasoned. Uh, uh, a well, uh, I was going with that. A fine bottle of wine, but these guys, of course, naturally grew up with every bit of technology known to mankind. Yeah. And they they know how to do that before we can even get out of bed in the morning. This is how that works. Yeah. So we, as a group, we get the benefit of both worlds: real experience and people that uh, are bringing something to the table. So Ivan, why don't we start at your side? Why don't we? Why don't you introduce yourself? Tell us a bit about you and. Um, where you live and all that kind of stuff. Uh, okay, my name is uh, Ivan Rodriguez. I'm from Spain, like he said. Uh, I'm going to be a realtor here in Las Terrenas with Go, Go Dominican Life. And I've been here in Las Terrenas for one year, but I was before in Puerto Plata for four years. Mm -hmm. And I love here. Yeah. And you also have experience doing uh, social media management yeah. for, uh, for outside uh, or small businesses as well, yeah. right? like uh, post uh, photos and videos for them, make videos for them to uh, get people uh -huh. to get uh, into the account and all that type. So languages are also important here in the Dominican Republic. I only have a limited amount of English. 
<laughs> but you speak English and Spanish. Yeah. Right? Any other languages? Uh, yeah, I speak Catalan. Catalan. But it's, it's from Catalonia in Spain. Mm -hmm. But I don't speak it here because I don't need to. Yeah, you don't need to. Yeah, yeah. exactly. All right, Zoran. Zoran. Hey, guys. My name is uh, My name is Zoran. I was uh, born in Santiago, but I lived in Holland for like 12 years. Now I moved back here and um, finished my school. And now I want to work with these guys in, uh, in real estate. But I'm in my uh, training phase right now where uh, I'm going to help the people that are already selling kind of uh, give them a better, better time and take away all their worries and, uh, you know, making them focus on all the selling. Uh, so that I can eventually get more more experience so that I can sell myself in the future. The interesting story about Zoran, uh, his mother works on the, on the team in Sasua as well. Yeah. Uh, but he started, uh, well, he's been working real estate in the background for about a year or so. Yeah, you, right? basically, yeah. Um, me and my mom kind of did our own little thing, and uh, I, I see a lot of behind the scenes. I would go with her. I would, um, I would see a lot of information. So I kind of know how the process goes, um, but yeah. But get this, so uh, before he, I, we only met like a few days ago, right? Yeah, like three days ago, Sunday, yeah. on Sunday. Yeah. Uh, and prior to that, we had a video call, and uh, of course, all mothers are saying, you gotta speak to my son, you gotta speak to my son. And of course we do. But what came out of that was interesting, because he was already working in the business, but not with us directly, right. but he was door knocking and prospecting. Yeah. So why don't you tell about the uh, famous pro uh, listing that you took in Porta Plata? So me and my friend were driving around in a, a neighborhood close to us, and we saw this big house, and it said for sale. And in one of the big posters, it said something about baseball. So I basically called the guy, and apparently we had this meeting, and me and my mom, we, we pulled up to the house, and we start talking with the guy. And it turns out that he is this baseball legend in Canada. I the Toronto Blue Jays. That's right. And um, he has this big house. And upstairs, there's an entire trophy hall. There's jerseys left and right. There's an entire trophy room. There's glass. There's like a bunch of stuff. Do you remember his name? <laughs> That's embarrassing because I don't remember his name either. <laughs> but, but the point is, is that uh, somebody who's just beginning. Right. Uh, does a, f a first uh, few days of door knocking yeah. gets the Pretty World lucky. Series championship uh, guy from the Blue Jays from yeah. the, the mid 80s and I had to say well that doesn't happen every day <laughs> that's just uh, a rarity but hey it shows uh, shows that uh, you can you can do what you need to do in this business right a I lot of it right. is uh, repetition and uh, grit so mm -hmm. you have that for sure and of course my main man Alex Alex we've been friends for Three years or so? Yeah. yeah. So uh, why don't you tell uh, tell the group about who you are? Who okay, are you? Uh, I'm Alexander Gomez, 49. I'm Dominican originally. Single? Single. <laughs> but uh, I lived in New York from the age of three to about 34, 36. And I came to the Dominican Republic. I landed in Samana and somehow migrated to Las Terrenas, which I fell in love and stayed here, became a part of the expat community, mainly the Northern American, mm -hmm. Canadian American. I'm from Queens, New York, I grew up there, so I had the language down pack, opened up a, a burger place here, which became the local hangout for the expats mm -hmm. at that moment. Mm -hmm. And uh, I have a little bit of background in real estate, uh, due to meeting all of the the expats that needed language, they wanted to buy something, so I dabbled in that. But um, I'm here in Gold Dominican Life, learning, mm -hmm. starting from scratch, training, because there's a big move in Las Terrenas, and uh, this company is growing very fast. I've been watching it from the outskirts, very proud mm -hmm. of what they're doing, and I got the opportunity to become a member, which I jumped to it, very grateful for that. And who can complain about working? across the street from the beach. Uh, we live in sandals and slippers. You can't see our feet, but none of us have shoes on. Uh, it's the best life. I wouldn't trade this for anything. Keep the snow in New York. I'm just fine here. And there's so many people interested in this particular town and knowing the information and knowing the background and the language. I feel like I fit in. 
and I'm very happy the new member yeah. with the new guys, the young guys, they're going to teach me a little thing or two. And we're going to show them the rest. Oh, that's right. That's right. <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> it's, yeah. This is how we're, this is the, uh, the, the dynamic that we're yeah. playing. Yeah, it's a balance. Look, uh, today is uh, September 1st, is it not? Yeah, yeah. September 1st. So today is the first day of our, of our new sales year. Uh, and just for the viewers to understand and subscribers, uh, in our last sales year, which ended yesterday, we Crazy year. we helped literally 300 families move and relocate and all that fun stuff, either through mortgage, our project called Vibe here in Las Terrenas, and soon to be Vibe in Sasua in the next uh, few days. We'll be uh, talking more about that. Uh, also with property management and mortgage. So we we have done a lot in a, a matter of a, a few years, but. Uh, 90% of our growth is based on having great quality people on our team that have skills and or are open-minded and have a, a, the gut instinct and a good attitude towards learning and life because I believe in my heart of hearts that if you have skills and a bad attitude, uh, there's nothing I can do to help anybody that way. You have to be willing and open to learn. And for us, we have chosen uh, as, a, as a company to mostly uh, grow from within. So bring people into the team, train them on the aspect of, uh, of real estate that they like to do. Uh, some uh, focus on administration and or marketing or web design or, or Lucian with video and DJ. Uh, and uh, of others that uh, want to learn the sales process. And you'll find too in the time that you're with us that you may, uh, you'll find your specialty. Because there's people like uh, Eugenio on our sales side. He uh, he does all of our web and uh, marketing, but he likes to work the land sale business right. for larger projects and division of land. So that's his. Uh, he's got lots of contacts in that division. For me, I enjoy doing the projects and planning. It all becomes part of sales, but in the end of the day, I can I think in multiples. Mm -hmm. And Ivan, you're going to be uh, do, have your find your motion. And your connection with social media management and to get the word out, that's 90% of the, the challenge is to get people to know who you are and that you're an active person in the community. And Alex, we're just like a fine ball of wine. We just uh, beat the ourselves. We age fine. <laughs> we age fine. <laughs> so our goal for this new sales year is to achieve... Uh, and help 500 families nationwide here in the Dominican Republic on all aspects that I've talked about in our company process. So we have a lot worked out for us. We have a lot of work to do, yeah. uh, but it starts on a daily basis with the right attitude and the training and organization. And everybody in our team is learning from the same process that I did. And I've said to these guys earlier uh, that uh, 25 years ago, I was sitting in their seat uh, with a guy that was 52 years old at that time, uh, 48 years old, I guess he was at that time, and I was 25 years younger than that, and that's how I learned. And uh, there's nothing better in, in this real estate business to learn from people that have done it at a high level because that's uh, how you gain experience. There's one thing I've always said. You can, you can get 10 years of experience doing one transaction a year yeah. in, or 10 transactions, or you can do... 20 transactions a month mm -hmm. and get 10 years of experience yeah. in less than six months. And that's true because it's the repetition, uh, not only the repetition, but the timeline of the intensity of it that allows you to learn the skills quicker than anything else. So, yeah. so Alex, what, uh, what do you do for fun? Uh, what, what, what other things? Because you're going to be working your butt off, but what else do you do? Basically, I have a group of friends that we get together mainly on the weekends. Because during the weekday days, I, I try not to do the party thing. Yep. But uh, Sunday is a big day here. Yeah. You know. Yeah, Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. Sunday. <laughs> uh, we get together, check out the beach. Yep. Yeah. Have a drink sometimes, mm -hmm. and just chat over the week. What the, what happened over our week? Yeah. And you're unique because you have uh, family in the North Coast, family in the Central yeah. uh, Sabao uh, region. Yeah. I have my dad in Santiago with a lot of my family and um, I have some friends in Sosua but I live in Puerto Plata so I'm kind of in like the center of everything um, but yeah I, I go to my dad I visit them uh, I hang out with my girlfriend 
I, uh, I go out sometimes. Who is from Italy? As Who's well. from Italy? Yeah. But she lives here, but she's from Italy. Yes, yeah, yeah. she is. Yeah. That's the cool part of this country. You got people from all over the world. So diverse. Yeah. yeah, very. Do you ever go to any baseball games in Santiago? Yes, I do. Actually, Lise, <laughs> uh, the Santiago team, uh, my dad has tickets every season. Okay. Yeah. So I actually go with him in the front seats, and I, yeah, and I have a lot of fun there. All right. And? Uh, basically the same. Uh, I love to hang out with my friends here. I uh, have a lot of friends in Puerto Plata too. Uh, I love soccer. Soccer, yeah. I love soccer. I'm waiting for this year to watch a World Cup here with my yeah, dad. Yeah. yeah. And that's all. I love to go out and have drink or dinner with my friends yeah, and have fun. Yeah. Well, we got a lot of work to do. This is just the beginning, so you're going to see these guys around in videos, uh, property videos and different uh, social media postings that we're going to do. But you know how you can reach us at all times at, uh, on our WhatsApp number at 829-525-1782. Uh, if you are looking to expand your horizons and want to explore your opportunities in real estate, we are always interested to talk to people that can bring different skills to the table. So reach out, talk to me. You can have a private conversation to see how that can work. But otherwise... Like this video, subscribe, give a like thumbs the video, up. Like the video. Let us know what we can do to help you. We hope we can uh, add you to our uh, success list of uh, 500 families in 2024. Yeah. All right? Yeah. Sounds good. Okay, boys. Hey. Here we go. Here we go. Adios. Bye-bye.